Hey there, health enthusiasts. Ever find yourself wondering why, despite your best efforts, you're still dragging through the day? Today we're diving deep into the energy abyss, exploring why you feel perpetually tired. Now we all know that maintaining high energy levels is not just a luxury, it's the cornerstone of overall well-being. This video is your ultimate guide to unlocking the secrets of sustained energy. We'll cover everything you need to know in four sections. Section 1. What does the signal of fatigue mean in the body? Fatigue, often brushed off as a consequence of a busy lifestyle, is more than just feeling tired. It's your body's way of signaling that something might be abnormal. From physical exhaustion to mental weariness, fatigue impacts every facet of our lives, influencing productivity, mood, and overall wellness. Addressing fatigue proactively is key. Instead of resorting to quick fixes like endless cups of coffee or energy drinks, we'll embark on a journey to understand the roots of fatigue and implement sustainable solutions. Section 2. What factors contribute to fatigue? Orexin and physical activity. Ever heard of orexin? It's the unsung hero in the realm of wakefulness. Orexin, a neuropeptide, plays a pivotal role in regulating arousal, wakefulness, and appetite. Regular exercise, as it turns out, is a potent trigger for orexin production. So if you find yourself in a midday slump, the solution might be as simple as a brisk walk or a quick workout to rev up your orexin levels. Caffeine and its impacts. Caffeine is the world's favorite pick-me-up. While that morning cup of coffee might feel like a lifesaver, the relationship between caffeine and energy isn't what you think. We'll unravel the intricacies, exploring how caffeine temporarily boosts alertness by blocking sleep-inducing chemicals in the brain. However, it's essential to strike a balance. Too much caffeine can lead to dependency and disrupt your natural energy rhythms. In this section, we'll weigh the pros and cons, empowering you to harness caffeine's benefits without falling into the trap of overconsumption. How to maximize the benefits of coffee. 1. Synchronize your coffee intake at least two hours after you wake up as your cortisol levels peak. This will create a sustained flow of energy. 2. Mindful moderation. While the temptation might be to drown in coffee, moderation is the key. Too much caffeine can lead to tolerance, where your body becomes less responsive to its effects. 3. Caffeine is a diuretic, and staying hydrated ensures you don't experience the energy zapping effects of dehydration. Remember, the goal isn't just a burst of energy, but sustained alertness. How fasting affects fatigue. Fasting, when done mindfully and intermittently, can be a game changer for your energy levels. 1. Cellular repair. During fasting, your body isn't busy digesting food, so it shifts gears. Autophagy, a process where your cells remove damaged components, kicks in. This cellular spring cleaning can enhance overall cellular function, contributing to increased energy. 2. Insulin sensitivity. Fasting helps regulate insulin levels. When you eat, especially carbohydrates, your body releases insulin to manage blood sugar. Over time, excessive insulin production can lead to insulin resistance, making it harder for your cells to use glucose for energy. Mitochondrial function. Fasting appears to enhance mitochondrial health. Mitochondria are the powerhouses of your cells, responsible for generating energy. Improved mitochondrial function translates to more efficient energy production, potentially leaving you feeling more energized. How does overeating drain your energy? The saying, you are what you eat, holds profound truth, especially when it comes to energy levels. Overeating can lead to a surge in blood sugar followed by a crash, leaving you more lethargic than invigorated. In this segment, we'll explore the connection between excessive eating and the subsequent energy drain. 1. Digestive overload. Overeating overwhelms the digestive system, diverting a significant amount of energy to the digestive process. With this in mind, why have we been advised to eat multiple times in a day? The concept of eating frequent small meals is really key to not only losing weight, but to maintaining weight. 2. Blood sugar roller coaster. Your blood sugar levels can spike when you consume a large amount of food, especially those high in refined carbohydrates. The subsequent drop in blood sugar levels can leave you feeling tired and sluggish. 3. Inflammatory response. Some foods, especially processed and high sugar options, can trigger inflammation in the body. Chronic inflammation is energy draining and can contribute to a persistent feeling of tiredness. In essence, the key is finding a balance. Section 3. How to keep your insulin steady. Insulin, often associated with blood sugar management, plays a crucial role in energy regulation. Insulin steps in to facilitate the absorption of glucose into cells, providing a burst of energy. However, this process can lead to energy crashes if not managed well. Incorporating adequate protein and healthy fats into your diet can mitigate the impact of insulin spikes, contributing to a steadier release of energy. What micronutrients are important for optimal energy? The body requires a spectrum of vitamins and minerals for optimal functioning and deficiencies in these micronutrients can significantly affect energy levels. 1. Iron and vitamin B12 are crucial for energy production at the cellular level. Iron is essential for the transportation of oxygen in the blood. When iron levels are low, 
the body struggles to deliver oxygen to cells, resulting in sluggishness and tiredness. This vitamin is commonly found in animal products, making it important for those following vegetarian or vegan diets to consider supplementation. 2. Magnesium Magnesium is involved in energy metabolism and muscle function. Inadequate magnesium levels can contribute to fatigue and muscle cramps. Ensuring a well-rounded, nutrient-dense diet that includes a variety of foods rich in protein, healthy fats, vitamins, and minerals is key to maintaining optimal energy levels. Section 4. What lifestyle factors should you focus on improving? 1. Hydration. When the body is not adequately hydrated, blood volume decreases, making the heart work harder to pump blood and deliver nutrients and oxygen to cells. Aim for an adequate daily water intake. Adjusting based on factors like physical activity and climate, incorporating hydrating foods such as fruits and vegetables can also contribute to overall fluid balance. 2. Sleep quality and stress. During sleep, the body undergoes essential processes like tissue repair, immune system strengthening, and memory consolidation. Disrupting these processes through poor sleep can lead to fatigue. Stress, both physical and emotional, is a significant contributor to sleep disturbances and fatigue. Chronic stress activates the body's fight-or-flight response releasing stress hormones like cortisol. Elevated cortisol levels can interfere with sleep patterns, leading to restless nights and daytime tiredness. Prioritizing good sleep hygiene and managing stress are crucial. Key insights. We've explored the role of orexin and physical activity, the impacts of caffeine and fasting, as well as the connection between nutrition, hydration, sleep quality, and stress on fatigue. A holistic approach to health involves not just addressing one aspect, but creating a synergy among various elements. A well-balanced lifestyle that incorporates regular exercise, mindful nutrition, proper hydration, sleep quality, and stress management can lead to sustained energy levels. If you're passionate about health and well-being, consider subscribing to our channel. We'd love to hear from you. Feel free to share your thoughts, experiences, or any questions you might have in the comments below. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to show your appreciation by hitting the like button.